What's up everybody, I'm Shade, welcome back to Become a Legend episode 35 and as I've told you, I have a little bit of surprise for you. Something you have been asking for me for 34 episodes is to change up the difficulty and finally we do because of the last matches Cole was just scoring left and right so I, I just assumed that it was time for to step it up a bit and just see how it goes on professional. Now why haven't I done it before? Well, it's because I told you I want Become a Legend to be kind of a chill series for me. I know I probably overused that word, but I don't want it to be a struggle to score to have like 10 episodes with one goal. So, um, I just wanted to keep it fun, uh, not only for me to play, but for you to watch. So, professional should be a balance of that. And there, there's an ambulance outside, I hope you don't hear that. But, uh, so Cole gets one assist right off the bat. It's against, um... Uh, to be honest, I have no idea what who we are up against, but uh, what should should you expect because of the difficulty change now? Well, one thing you should probably expect less goals, of course, and but um, while the quantity of goals may be lower, uh, the quality of goals should in, in, in improve, and that should be a um, a proof in the very next match. Cole with the fake shot inside the box. It, they're so hard, so much harder to to pull off now, simply because the defenders aren't um, are pretty good now. And uh, you, you you probably saw there they had two defenders to mark Cole. Their very smart move to just mark the highest threat in in a team. Uh, Lucas Mura gets uh, the diving header right on the pitch there to make it two 0 So goal, Cole only credited for one goal with the assist. Lucas Mora gets a deflection, um, it gets a rebound, should I should say. Uh, it was off call, so. But we move on to bigger and better things. I told you we only have to face Brazil left in our group uh, in the International Cup. So that is the match right here, and it's going to be on professional. Uh, also, we get a message that, Korea, that uh, Sao Paulo were eliminated in the Brazilian League or Cup or something, and I was like, when did that happen? But then I realized it probably was one of the matches that Cole didn't take part of because he was uh, fatigued. But anyway, this is the match with Brazil, and one thing I noticed right off the bat is that Cheni, the goalkeeper from Sao Paulo, the free kick taker from Sao Paulo, was the keeper for Brazil and Ronaldinho was in the team but they picked Chenny to take the free kick and they made a wise choice because he got a very good free kick in and make it 1-0 to Brazil in uh, quite the early stages of the match Brazil were definitely playing uh, a lot better than England they were dominating every time England would uh, try to get a counter like these uh, the keeper comes out, ruins the one-on-one -on -one for Cole, and um, if, if we kept possession, they would be very dangerous on the counter. If we kept possession, if we tried to play the counter, they would just annihilate us with their passing and um, the sheer quality in their team. But then they get so many free kicks, and every time Chenyu would save up to take it, so we are like, if we get the ball back, just, just uh, give it to Cole and he'll knock it long. Cole doesn't even hesitate, knocks it long. And from inside his own half makes it 1-1 for England. I mean 1-1 in the game and what an unbelievable goal. Uh, England fans just going off their seats. Uh, Cole showing the name, the number on his kit 16, number 16. Cole has just scored a beauty of a goal. I, I'm going to leave the replay after every goal in this match because it's quite they're quite nice goals. And also, if you want me to make this a thing, to just give you a replay after every goal that is scored, uh, not, not just like uh, uh, Cole or the team, uh, I'll do that for you. So, 1-1 one, one at this point, Cole uh, making a good run inside the box. Uh, the cross eventually comes in and Cole at the near post with a deadly left-footed volley makes it 2-1. And as the commentator said, the comeback is complete. The Cole! Comeback is complete. Two goals for Cole. Two very good goals, actually. Uh, very nice, weak-footed volley at right at the near post. Cheney didn't even have a reaction to that, and uh, they we just kept kept going. Cole making a good run, seeing the pass, making the run again, takes the shot. Cheney saves that one, and uh, we keep actually going. <laughs> Keeper was having a good day at the office, but then they get a corner. Knocks it long, deflected. Alexander Pato with the bicycle kick over the top, over the over the head kick, and uh, we were kind of disappointed because we wanted 
this to be a win because of Cole, but that is a beautiful goal and you have nothing to say about that. Pretty much every goal that has been scored in this match was just a very good, beautiful goal and just a classy match against Brazil to, to just seal the group stages of the International Cup. So 2-2 two -two is what that finishes. Uh, Cole having two goals and let's just check in his stats and um, his skills are almost up. We almost have long range drive and the speed merchant and uh, speaking of speed merchant we really need that especially because of the difficulty change because uh, we just get all muscle off the ball very quickly and this match against uh, Flamengo was just uh, frustrating Cole couldn't even get anything I, I had to go back to include these uh, shots that uh, this was the only highlight and that's the match <laughs> so I only had one highlight so I just kinda had to go back and just include every shot that Cole uh, pretty much took and uh, I guess he was just mentally fatigued after the match with Brazil, not physically but mentally. So anyway, I was talking about a speed merchant. We really need that because of professional now, because um, I know it's pretty uh, OP, it's pretty overpowered, but we definitely need that to. Because Cole has the pace right now, but he doesn't even feel fast because the defenders just catch up and out muscle him because they are good now it kind of feels unfair when you're playing on a higher difficulty but we also need a lot the wrong range drive simply because we can't really cut inside the box as much as we used to and uh, we just have to shoot we are just re uh, reduced the shooting from afar so we have to be good in that but that's been this episode I hope you that you appreciate that I finally did it I finally switched to professional and I hope you enjoyed the goals in this episode I've been Shade thank you for watching if you enjoyed do leave a like also, before I forget, I will be uploading Cole's uh, goal from inside his own half separately just because I really liked it and I think it's a class goal. I know people do that. It's a, a kind of a glitch to shoot from inside your own half, but uh, that was different. That was kind of like um, taking advantage of the situation. But uh, I'll be uploading it tomorrow or the day after tomorrow, so I just give you all a chance to watch the episode and not ruin it for you. So uh, anyway, thank you again for watching. Goodbye.